Hey guys, I've arrived in Kanazawa, and it's about 10 degrees less than what it was in Tokyo there. Now what I wanted to try and do was uh, catch the last of the sunlight so that you can uh, at least see around the train station area. I'm not going to be able to film too much more than that today, but I've got a lot uh, planned over the next few days. So I'm staying at the APA right now, all the way up on the 12th floor. You talk about small rooms, oh my goodness. <laughs> Tell you what, we'll go this way. Now what we're going to do, we're going to head into the um, entrance, or it's actually the back entrance of Kanazawa Station. And we'll walk all the way through to the, uh, the front entrance, which is uh, where all the, uh, what can I say, highlights, I guess, of the station are. Now, I've been through the station already, of course, because this is where I came in. And the hotel is right next door to it. And they got a nice Christmas display right in the middle. Now, I'll try my hardest not to shout. They've also got some vegan noodles in here somewhere. Let me uh, cross over to the left side. But Kanazawa, they're not as fluent in English here. So you have to get the translator out. up to the Christmas display in the middle here. Scoot in front of a couple of people. Now I know it's a Buddhist country but they certainly put up the Christmas uh, decorations and displays here that's for sure. Yeah a lot of the uh, decorations are local. And that's something that I'll be learning over the next few days, of course. Now let's walk around to the front there. There are some people taking pictures at the front of the Christmas display. And as soon as they're done, I'll uh, flip around and show you the, uh, the front part. There we go. Now, I'm going to head out the uh, front portion right now. Hopefully there's enough daylight left to uh, show you the entrance to Kanazawa Station. They have a wooden structure here, which is uh, the resemblance of a gate to a shrine. And just in front of the shrine, which you can see right now, or the gate, they had a lovely little display that Hopefully we'll still get to see. It's like a man-made uh, mini river type thing. Now here in Kanazawa they have one of the top three gardens in Japan. And that's the place I'll be going to 
probably tomorrow. And then also, there's a place called Takaoka, which I'm also going to go to. And that has one of the top three Buddhas in Japan. A massive uh, display that is. Now the weather is supposed to be uh, pretty miserable the next few days. I don't know if this is going to take my fat ass. Let's have a look and see. Yes, it does. I know it's probably a bit dark for you, but we're going to have to make do for now. So I'm going to head to the front of uh, the entrance here. Hopefully it's not raining too bad out there. And then I'll flip around in a minute and uh, we can see what the entrance looks like. It was only a three hour journey as well on the Shinkansen. Oh look. Got a nice little light display there. There's a bus loop somewhere around here. Might well be that one, uh, number 96, probably not. Right, so there's not much uh, I can do right now, because I just got here. Actually looks really cool. This is the entrance to Kanazawa Station here. Now I've been tilting the camera up lately and uh, tilting it up a little too high. So this time I'm not going to tilt it at all. So it's a short video today. Which is fine, because I ain't got no viewers at the moment, anyway. So for the ten of you watching this, <laughs> uh, I hope you enjoy it. Obviously, I've got plenty more to come. Uh, I'm going to have enough videos from Japan to last for, uh, for months. I was actually hoping it would light up in like uh, some type of, type of Christmas display. But I'm not seeing any external lights other than the uh, normal floodlights. So we'll do once more through the uh, through the station and that'll pretty much do us for today's video I have no idea what I'm gonna eat today
Like I said, English isn't the uh, prime language here. So I might have to struggle with my uh, very broken Japanese. Yep, well, there's not much else uh, to do there. So let's head back through. Oh, look, there's some Christmas lights down here. When in Rome, as they say. And they've actually got a Tower Records there, which is uh, pretty cool, because I'm still one CD short. So hopefully I can get that in uh, that tower records. I also want a second hand store because uh, there's some items I couldn't get in Tokyo. <laughs> and perhaps here in Kanazawa I might be able to uh, pick them up. A teapot, I have no idea what the significance of that is. That's something you don't see every day. The sculpture of a teapot. So that says Porus. It looks like it's some type of shopping mall. So I'll look that up online when I... Uh, get back and maybe it'll be a place I uh, head into tomorrow there's a row of Christmas trees down there or Christmas lights on trees and don't look like there's much beyond that but Extended the video a little bit, didn't it? What are we up to? 12 minutes, perfect. Imagine this is a place for uh, a night out, you know? Meet me at the teapot. My eyes, unfortunately, aren't good enough to see what that says over there. Not at this time of night. And to top it off, neither of my credit cards worked in the uh, hotel, so I had to use my debit card. Which is something I didn't want to do, because now I'll have to pay 3% on top of that. Yeah, I've got one of those travel rewards cards that I don't have any fees on. So I'm a little annoyed. But as long as it works in Tokyo, because that's where my mainstay is. At least if I can put half the uh, price on there. Okay, so there's actually the loops that I want. That's pretty cool, it gives you a good idea. Um, so I need to take the left loop, I think it is, tomorrow. So it looks like it's at bus stop 7, and they're pretty, uh, pretty well marked there. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to go to the old Kan Kanazawa Castle. There's a ninja village. 
which by all accounts is a Karelia ninja village. But it's done up to resemble a ninja village. So what I'm going to do, I think I'm going to switch the video off here. And I'm going to pop in this store and see what they got in there. Alright guys, tune back and uh, subscribe if you like the videos. And I'll catch you guys soon.